Good morning. I am assigned to discuss the art in different parts of the Philippines, which are the Bilaan art, Subanon art, and Bajau and Samo art. So, Bilaan art, they live in Lake Buluan, North Cotabato. They make various kinds of home crafted objects and pillows stuffed with banana leaves or cogon flowers. They make intricately carved betel nut boxes made of brass. Bilaan is a combination of two words, which Bela means house and An, which means people. They are known of embroidery brass ornaments and beadwork that are integrated in their tra traditional clothing. Bilaan have a waving tradition, so they have a system of waving using abaca fiber. The art of abaca waving is called mabal or mabal tabi, while the cloth proceeds by this process called the tabi. So bilaan wavers to do, do not use spinning wheels. Instead, they join together by hand strands of the abaca fiber, which then used to wave the tabi. So Fuya Bing Dolo was one of the surviving master designers left of the Mabal Tabi, art of ikat waving. And also they have brass and copper work and bed work. The Bilaan have a tradition of creating art from brass and copper. The Bilaan smelt brass and copper to produce small bells and handles of long knives. These knives called the face are made with intricately designed brass. The bilaan also sew plastic beads or shelly sequence to create intricate designs on women's blouses and trousers called the takmo. Geometric and other designs depicting the environment or the solar system are sewn using cotton yarns onto men's pants and shirts, called the m -set. Next is the Sabanon art. They compose the largest group of indigenous people in the Sambuanga Peninsula. They weave baskets made into bamboo and wood. Unlike the glazed imported jars in some households, the indigenous earth Earthenware of the Subanon are simpler in execution and design. Every household has at least one who is knowledgeable in the art of pottery and who turns out jars as required by domestic needs. Next, the Bajau and Samoa. The Samoa are secondary coastal dwellers while the Bajau are sea nomads who lives in Tawi-Tawi, Saisi, Holo, and Zamboanga. The Bajau and Sama depends almost entirely on the sea for subsistence. Sama art consists of okil and gulis. Geometric design on venta sails are examples of this art. So, the venta is a traditional outrigger boat from the Philippine island of Mindanao. The boats are made by Sama Bajau, Tausog, and Yakan peoples living in, in the Sulu archipelago, Zamboanga Peninsula, and southern Mindanao. Venta are characterized by their colorful rectangular log sails, or we say bukai, and before catered prose and sterns which resemble the gapping mouth of a crocodile. So the name Venta is predominantly used in Zamboanga, Basilan, and other parts of mainland Mindanao. It is also known as Pilang or Pelang among the Sama Bajau of the of the Tawi Tawi Islands. Dapang or Depang among the Tausog in Sulu and Balanda or Binta in Yakan in Basilan. It can also be generically referred to as an as Lipalepa, Sakayan, or Bangka, which are native names for small outrigger vessels.